what is good guys be sure to check out part one in the last video where i break down the depth charts and things like that but today we're looking at the base play and it gets its own video because it's so critical and important to a scheme is establishing your base play because you can run this for a good majority of the game now the play we're running is halfback wheel flipped out of the single back snugs flipped um the reason we flip it is because of that slot wide receiver on the left side um, there's a couple reasons. First off, if you motion him towards the outside and hike it while he's in motion, as you can see, he just gets crazy separation against the defenders. Um, and you can lead him upfield with the pass lead up, or you can just throw it across his body, um, pass leading it towards the right. But uh, either way, you're going to get nice separation. And the other reason we flip the play is because if you leave the play stocked like this, the, it creates a man switch and as you can see the defender is like seven yards ahead of your wide receiver so if you just hit him really fast uh, before he reaches the defender you'll be able to get a nice pickup as well now the corner route has been beating man all year um, towards the outside so if he's open you can go ahead and hit him up and then for that B receiver on the deep corner towards the inside just pad, pass lead those inside after his cut or you can pass lead it down depending on where the defender is you know practice this a, a little bit definitely practice it get used to making the passes get used to making the reads and last but definitely not least is that halfback on the wheel route um, a lot of times guys blitz a lot and you can hit them for a quick pickup uh, if he gets past the defenders, like in this case, you can hit him over the top. You can feel free to wheel him to the other side if they start zoning one side and really not covering them. So there's a lot of things that halfback can do. It can bail you out in a lot of situations. And since he's on a wheel route, you can usually precision pass inside and beat the man defender that way. Now, again, zone coverage, the various zones will just affect our reads. We're still going to go with the same hot routes. Again, you can leave that slot receiver on the left either on the stock route or you can motion hike them to the left now the one hot route you do want to make against man and zone is to put that far left wide receiver which is x in this case on a curl route now against mo most zone defenses either that curl or that deep corner towards the inside is going to be wide open like every single time so if that curl is not open in the pocket just to be hit then look over the top and you should see that deep corner route or not corner deep angle route i don't even know deep in whatever you want to call it that route gets j boogie money now against cover two uh graham will get loose but pretty much any other zone he'll be shut down so you know be careful when you're making that pass to graham um of course if that running back gets loose or if they don't have a zone in that area you can hit him for a quick pickup or if you wait on him he'll usually get over the top of that purple or flat zone and make a play down the field Another guy you can hit is that motion hike or that, you know, slot left receiver on a standard route. And what you can do there is just hit him in between the zones or hit him underneath the zones for a nice pickup, you know, varying from two to seven yards, somewhere in that range. Now, against cover four, here's a neat little trick. That curl route will actually suck down that safety that's in that um, deep zone, that deep blue. So as you can see, that safety that's supposed to be covering that area uh, leaves his assignment basically to cover the curl and it leaves the inside pass lead wide open on that deep corner route and likewise if you flip the play you can always feel free to flip the play I just like coming out and it flipped because of the man switch and because of the things that does to the defense as well so I hope y'all enjoyed the first part this is the base play for the stop two scheme. I really hope y'all enjoyed and hope y'all looking forward to the rest of this. Till the next time, get your practice time in. We out of here. Y'all be easy.